expecting much, more just to be a role player, whatever they needed me to be. The only thought I had was, I don't want to sit the bench the whole game. You know, I just wanted some minutes. That was my goal. And all of a sudden, I was starting. We, had, we just had so many good players on our team, and they're holding most of the records here for women's basketball. And so, um, they're role models. They all taught me a little bit that leadership role that just the young players expect you to have. I know I expect a lot of myself, and I know they expect a lot of me just because of my experience here. And so, you know, I have to be that go-to player. I have to be that leader, or I have to be able to talk, and I have to be able to get, get it through to them because what I do now, just how Diana or Cartesia, you know, last year you had Rashonda and Carly and Kim. So we had young players be able to watch them and kind of follow after what they left. And this year there's only me, and so um, trying to do that for 11 or 12 other players is harder, but uh, something that has to be done, and I don't mind that position. I guess I wasn't expecting to have as successful of a career as I have, and for basketball-wise, that is something that has um, been really memorable and made it really great for coming here um, to SIU. That's what some of the most memorable things from being a Saluki. I have just the games and practices, I kind of everything almost this whole season. Uh, I don't think it'll really hit me until the, the day after our season is done and I'm not putting practice shoes on anymore. Um, I'll miss playing in front of a home crowd. Miss traveling, I'm trying to take in that because everybody's goofy on the team, like has a funny side and that's when it kind of shows in, in the back of the bus when we're traveling or when you have a certain roommate in the hotel room or when we go shoot around or when we have team dinners and things that sometimes aren't related to basketball but it's still with the team is um, something I'm trying to, to not take for granted. To me it's not really about um, the stats and the numbers and that that I'm leaving behind. It's more of you know how good of a teammate was I and how coachable was I. You know how easy was it for my coaches and my teammates to work with me on the floor. That's more important than um, any stat line or any uh, um, record, I should say.